much film you guys watch it on George Bridges. What have you seen from that defense so far? Um, they play hard. Yeah. A lot of good players, and they play hard, and we got a match them on Saturday. How was the, the bye week? You felt like you guys got better? Yeah, it was good. It was, uh, it was, it's always good, you know, just to go back and start focusing on yourself a little bit and uh, make some corrections that, that you've had in the first five games, and I feel like we did that, so it was a good week. Did you guys get any pressure, I mean, preparation up for Georgia during those three practices? Or was it like uh, we got a few periods in, yeah. What kind of a challenge does this Georgia defense present you guys as sort of tight ends? Um, a problem we have is sustaining our blocks. You know, um, sometimes we're on the backside and we don't hold our blocks as long as we should. And against these guys, you gotta you gotta hold on to them because they're gonna they're gonna chase down a play and make a play for. Them. And we gotta block them the whole time. What stands out with kind of their edge guys? Um, they're all good. You know, they got a starter, but the once the starter comes out, the second guy up, he's good too. So. Uh, the depth is real, real strong in that position. What was the key to running the football a couple weeks ago against Kentucky? You think? Uh, I think running the ball is always a mindset. Um, if you come in with the mindset, you're going to run the ball. Uh, it, you going to be successful. And I think uh, we made it made it a priority that week, and uh, it worked out for us. The sense of desperation that we saw when you played Alabama, kind of going all out to make plays. Are you sensing it's going to be similar? Against Georgia, a team that's, that's comparable. Yeah, I mean, we need we need to have that that desperation every week. Um, we can't turn on, turn off. Um, so we just need to be more consistent um, in that play. Being able to run the ball like you guys did against Kentucky is this a better indication of what the identity of this offense is trying to be? Uh, yeah, um, we work on running a lot, um, and it's it, it opens a passing game for for the offense, and it's a, it's a key to our offense for sure. Is this the most, I guess, two tight end personnel that you've run in your time here so far? Uh, yeah, yeah. I think it's a um, important package for us this year, and I think it's it's being successful so far. How productive do you guys feel like you can be with you and I think Nick on the field at the same time? Um, I, I love it. You know, um, it causes mismatches with the with the linebackers, and it's. Uh, I think we can be one of the best tight end groups in the nation. What is that, does having Nick open up kind of for you? Um. No, I mean, he's, he's it, I don't know, it doesn't really open up much, but uh, it's, it's, he's a good mass, uh, mismatch, and uh, having two linebackers cover us, is um, it bodes well for us. How much has it talked about the lack of success you've had against Georgia the last couple of years? Prior to that, you had a tremendous amount of success over this decade against Georgia, I know before you got here, but how much uh -huh. did y'all talk about wanting to kind of reestablish the success against Georgia? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a rival, you know, so. Um, like any other SEC East game, um, it's it's important for us to get on the winning side, and it hasn't been that way in a couple of years. And we need to get back to back to what they used to do against those guys. At the start of the season, did you foresee yourself being as productive in the passing game as you've ended up being, or did it maybe even surprise <clears> you a little bit? <throat> no, I've always been confident in my ability to um, open up in the passing game, but uh, I've had more opportunities this year with uh, the the tight end situation and. Um, it's it's worked out well. Do you feel like you kind of did you sort of go into it saying I've got these opportunities I've got to kind of make the best of them or um, most of them I should say. Yeah, yeah, I guess, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. How much do you guys practice with like artificial noise and stuff for a road game like that? Um, a lot. A lot. Uh, today during punt period we we were, we were focused on that because you know it's going to be loud and um, it's going to be hard to hear in there.